number one for today is long queues and what ride to go on first. Swarm is one of the closest rides that you can get on when you enter the park. It is one of the main roller coasters that you can see apart from stealth. So to avoid big queues like these, try and be an early bird because the early bird catches the worm. Nah, I'm joking. Right, so to avoid queues like this, try and come as early as you can when the line is zero. You might even be the first person to get on the ride in one day. It ranges to about 11 o'clock when uh, queues start to get about 60 minute wait. So guys, adding to tip number one, during the day you can go onto the Thought Park app or you can look on the billboards around the park to see what uh, rides have the least amount of queue time. So uh, The Walking Dead only has 10 minutes and it's currently the middle of so tip number two is that if you go to the mega store which is located next to storm search and you want to buy a product from here if you have an annual pass you can get 20 percent off food and retail off the normal price so it is a lot cheaper for you guys so if you didn't know that then get to the mega store buy something and get your 20 percent discount off so enjoy Tip number three is to get yourself some fast track. If you've never been to Thought Park before, then fast track is the one to get you onto as many rides as possible. Um, it ranges from about five pound to ten pound, bearing uh, whether what ride you go on. So, put some fast track and information and get yourself some fast track. It's well worth. If you've never been here before, you are hundred percent better to buy an ultimate fast track that can get you on any ride however much you want it is 90 pounds if you buy it from Ireland but it is 50 pounds if you buy it online so guys if you want to get your day full full of fun then go down buy some fast track buy it on the app buy it online as it's cheaper and it will get you straight through your day Tip number four is food. So, and a little bit of retail as well. So guys, if you have an annual pass, you can get 20% off anything from a Fort Park uh, franchise like Pizza Pasta, uh, which is a really good place to go if you are hungry, and the mega store located next to Storm Surge. So, um, Pizza Pasta is £10 if you have an annual pass to get unlimited pizza, pasta and drinks for free. Um, it is really good, it's really cheap for what you get. There are other places around the park like KFC and all of that stuff, Burger King, but they don't get the annual pass discount. For times around 12 to 2, is when it gets really busy for food and some places can't let you in because it's too busy. So I recommend going either after two or just before 12 to get your food straight away, get it fresh and hot, so uh, yeah. So guys, for tip number five, if you can't afford fast track or just don't want it and all the queue times for all the big rides are about 60 minutes, there are a lot of flat rides around the park.
Crush, Vortex, Samurai, um, you name it, Flying Fish, Quantum, they're all there for you to go out. These uh, flat rides range for about 5 minutes to 20 minutes, so if you don't really want to wait for a big ride, then let it die down, or you can go on a flat ride, so yeah. And here is a bonus tip for Fort Park Resort. So as you can see on the screen right now, this way or this way, wherever it is, um, to download the Thorpe Park Resort app. This has tons of places. It has the map that you can get. Um, it, uh, so you could go to any place from your destination right now. You have, you can buy fast tracks on there. You can see the queue times. It's just an all in all really good app. So you're probably looking at it right now. So when you get to the park, download it. It will help you throughout your day. And it doesn't take up a lot of storage on your phone. So uh, yeah, take that in mind. Please subscribe, like, share with all your friends. And I'll see you in the next video.